Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. This is the Crafty Cockney, bringing you more Murdered Soul Suspects. Where we left off last time, we just read the memory here, and found out that this young lady is staying in the attic of this church. I don't think it's going to be particularly easy getting up there. Ooh. Many types of objects are discovered in Salem. Pay attention to your surroundings as you explore. Even the simplest paper can reveal secrets about Salem. The Bell Tower Banshee. Need ten more to uncover the story. I think it's important we have a proper look around over it. Oh shit, we can't go that way. We've got to have a sword. Doing alright with them. There's no demons, it's just fucking holes in the floor. And there's a dude vacuuming. We cannot step on that. Sounds are so fucking creepy. I'm quite tempted to step on it and see what happens. <laughs> I don't think it'd be a good idea. Here. I just can't stop loving him. Some creepy dude next to you. Let's see what these people up here are saying. A lot of prayers going up right now. Not just hers. He wouldn't come in here, would he? Would he? So she's hiding from someone. Save us from the dark tribes to come. Deliver us from the shadow of the evil. Ronan's fedora. If there's someone up there, please start protecting us. There's one promise I never regretted. Ah, uh, it's them. their wedding day. So we got here, we got clues. Side cases. You guys wanted me to read some of the notes, so I'm going to read today. We're going to read um, our wives. Every time Ronan says Lillian, I don't know if he's talking about his mother or his gun. It complicates things that the gun was a gift from his mother, and then he named it after her. Normal couples don't deal with stuff like this. No. It's usually the engaged people who are nervous about meeting the parents of their intended, but I was looking forward to it. Ronan's parents were nervous, stumbling over themselves to make a good impression. Ronan's dad was all thumbs and really quiet, like he was repressing his own crude nature. It was sweet though, and Lillian was a rough gem. Such a good heart. I hope they understand how much I adore them. We watched an old black and white gangster movie marathon together. Right before last, night before last. Sorry, the Brighton's very hard to read. Uh, I couldn't believe he'd never seen them. I love the romantic parts. He loved the tough guy parts. When I bought him the fedora the next day, he looked confused but adopted it so quickly. It's just a part of him now. I don't think he'll ever take it off. The man is who he is. I can't help myself. I tried to stay away to be sensible, to consider someone I could actually share a normal life with. But I find myself thinking of Ronan all the time, and I can't stop. Can't. This is it. This is what real love is. Aww. I didn't ev What? I didn't even have to ask about the car stealing tattoo. I hate it. It's garish, crude, common. It can sense my disapproval, but I suppose it's too late. All tattoos come with the danger of regret. 
And last one, day at the beach. The pictures we took at the beach came out surprisingly well, considering it was almost dark. The one I got of Ronan just as the sun was setting was brilliant. It wasn't much for catching Ronan's features, but my, what a silhouette that man had cut. He makes everything around him look good. Salem could use that shot to sell itself as a beach resort. There you go. I did it. You asked for it. You got it. I read the bloody notes, right? What? Now we need to get upstairs somehow and avoid these bloody... These bloody bloodies. That does not sound good at all. Well, I'm not going that way. So how do we get up there? Oh, there's something out here. Oh, it's just a dead bird. Oh, should we just take the stairs? Oh, we can't, for fuck's sake. Oh, nothing down here. Need seven more to uncover the story. It'd be nice to uncover it. At least one of the stories. Okay, let's head upstairs, if we can. There's lots of hiding spots, which worries me. Can we tickle the old ivories? You are me, I'll sing it, son. Collect. Organ. What? Oh, organ. I thought you meant as in, like, hearts and livers. <laughs> they mean the instrument. <laughs> This organ, rebuilt in 1919, is dedicated to the souls of this parish lost in the Great War. Now, I know I could go in that door, but I just want to... Carry on, see if there's any goodies. There's one on the other side of that... I can't reach. Is this somewhere we can hide? Oh! There you go, that's how we get through walls. Near this spot, the original St. Benedict's Rectory was lost to flames in 1901. That's good that we can just kind of morph through areas to remember that. You son of a bitch! Six more of those bad boys. So where the bloody hell do we go? <gasps> Why did I just go? <gasps> the drop's not going to kill us, is it? <laughs> right. Oh, come on. That's how we do it, baby. Hello, dead people. Seven of thirty-eight. I asked him to ask me again. I was lucky he hadn't left me after I never answered his first proposal. He must really love me. He smirked and got down on one knee, kneeling right in a dirty puddle on the street. He didn't care because he knew what he, what this meant. I'd already made up my mind. Finally, he grabbed my hands and said, "Will you?" And I just said yes. Didn't even let him get to the part about the marry me. We just knew and we laughed. That was a very good sign. It's so sad that she died. I wonder if they'll show us how she died. Ooh, and it makes me wonder. I think getting up to the full floor is going to be a bit difficult. No, not full floor. The attic. I'm thinking about that bloody building. How do we go up? 
Oh, you just walked through that wall. Oh no, that's him hoovering. Can't go through that wall. No. Puzzle after bloody puzzle. We cannot step on that shit. This is really frustrating. you get to an attic? Just keep going up, right? Exit. Let's have a look at this. Okay, third floor attic. How do I get down there? So we're definitely in the right area. We're kind of in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well, even though it was by accident, we now know that we definitely can't step on them fucking things. You, you need lightning reactions as well to get out of that. Ah, buggery bollocks. I haven't got to collect all that shit again. Oh, we've got to do this. Fuck's sake. Wasn't there a clue about the church and the apartment? Yes, there was. She's been staying in the attic. You can't go skip check that it out. shit, which is good. Save us from the dark tribes to come. I've got to do all this. I don't want to leave it. Well, it's not. Right. Don't step on that, you pillock. Father, can I have a piggyback? Can I, can I possess him? If I could possess him and he could carry me over, that'd be good. Oh, yeah, I can. This place is so cold tonight. Ah, I like it. Dispossessed. Thanks for the lift, Governor. The attic must be up there. Find a way to the attic. Oh, there's a demon in there. There's a demon. Right, so look for some more clues and shit. I don't know, Angie. Brian is a lovely boy, but he's a great guy. But she's right about his mother. Marrying her love. That's all that counts. Yeah. Great. Boring. Boisterous people, and I worry about the pressures of their relationship. 
poltergeist. What? So I can just turn shit on. That's quite cool. It's there. That was very, that was clean as a whistle. Four more. Doing alright with these saws. So I guess we need to get up the stairs, of course. Music's all gone a bit funky dunky. See any more demons? Okay. Can't wait till this one is over. Where do they get their help? Wasn't a lot more specific. Look at that. Just look at it. You call that. Okay, I can't see any more demons just yet. This would never happen in my kitchen. Cool okay? story, bro. Oh, yes, sir. Aha! Yes. Uh -huh. Three more. husband's Irish family, but my family, the Winslows. We got all the way. I don't think there was anything the else in it. We settled in Salem in the 1600s. We invented Thanksgiving. The fairy tale. They weren't high school sweethearts. No, no demons. Aha. Hold L2. Can the cat press the buttons for me? <laughs> Cat obviously can't go through doors. Oh, the air vent. Shoot, cat, get out of here. Quarterback for the witches all four years at Salem High. He was on the varsity when he was a freshman. Why do we need to get into here? Can we run across this? Yeah, we can. I'm not sure about the significance of the air vent. Can't go through walls. It's quite cool being able to control the cat though. How do we get out of here? Ah. 
This is amazing. Who thought of that would be a good idea? Which way we gotta go? Well, that's a dead end. I guess we go this way. Go, you little shits. There you go. You kidding me? Spider cat. It's one way getting up to the acid. <laughs> we made it to the acid. Do we have a new objective now? We let the pussy cat go now. Cheers, little fella. There she is, finally. Why do I always lose my keys when I need to leave? How can I get through to her? I don't know. Try kicking her ass, I suppose. Alright guys, well, we're going to call it there. We just possessed a fucking cat. That was awesome. <laughs> if you enjoyed that, guys, remember to hit the old like button. And I will catch you beautiful bastards for the next part of Murdered Soul Suspect. This has been the Crafty Cockney. And leaders.